at a home. So I believe Tyler is the player one here, the Sheik. Alright. So, you start off here, and Samus is charging her, her um, ball. It'd probably be good if you, like, ran in needled to, like, disrupt the charge. Because, like, no matter what, you get a free charge by going in here. Um, Sheik's really good at just disrupting charges, because she can just needle you from, like, across the stage. Um, so let's just, like, analyze this sort of trade right here. So, like, so Samus, ooh, oh, I hate what does that. Okay, Samus has one of the worst roles in the game, right? Where it's, like, if she's in her ball, you can still hit her, because she has some of the worst, like, frame data. I'm pretty sure it was, don't quote me on this, but I'm almost certain it's because um, when they made Brawl, they didn't change the animations. They just left them as they were. So, if like a Samus rolls, you should like be punishing her really hard. So, let's just take a look. You, um, the problem with why you can punish her is because you full hopped. So, like, you don't really need to be worried about Samus ever <laughs> as like a Sheik. Samus is really bad, like bottom 10. Um, like, you, it's alright to stay low to the ground because she, <coughs> cause she jumps and falls so slowly. You can like usually react to whatever she's going to do. So if she like jumps backwards at you, you know she's going to like, you sort of know she's going to back air you. So it's all right to like not full hop and just stay around here. Um, this area she can zare you, but like her zare is not that good because she falls so slowly. Um, see if you were like if you just did a short hop here, if you did a short, oh, fuck this, why is YouTube so bad? If you did a short hop here, you would have been here, and you could have like fast folded into an air, and then maybe done a bouncing fish after it. So that probably would have been better. And um, you bait out an up smash, but once again, you jump way too high, and you don't get a punish. Um, so what you got to remember is the higher you jump, the longer it takes you to get down. So if you bait out an option like an up smash, you want to be cl as close to them as you possibly can without getting hit. So like maybe you should have fall down a bit, jump, and then fall down. Um... Sheik's down aerial is really bad, so probably don't ever use that. Um, except in really certain things, like you can down air on Diddy Kong's banana and there's no lag, or down air to hit sh uh, Fox out of his up B. Um, that's a good punish on the grab. Um, I don't, I don't think, I think that was just a, you randomly throwing out a, a dance wish, then like you punishing it on a raid. But if you did raid that, that's really good. Also here. You're stuck in lag because you didn't do the second hit of Bouncing Fish. Always do the second hit of Bouncing Fish. It's always safer to do second hit of Bouncing Fish. So always do that. Like, always send out another kick so that you get out of the lag earlier. So you charge Needles and you fully charge them. And she's just charging. And she gets a free charge. So you should just hit her with Needles. Because, like, then you get percent on her. And then she also lo completely loses her charge. Um... So, like, this is an instance where your, like, decision-making was sort of flawed. Because, like, you're bouncing fish, right, to, like, catch her coming forward and moving down from a jump. But she has another jump. So, like, she can just get out of it really easily and just fall down. And luckily it's Samus, so she, like, falls super, super slow. So she couldn't punish you. So I guess in that sense it wasn't that bad of a... <laughs> an option, but like if you were to do it on any other character, they would punish you pretty hard for that. Like if you were to do that on like a fox, you get drilled to up smash, to grab, to whatever. Um, and you you beat it out her dare with your up air, because up air is just a stupid move. But good up air. Um, she air dodges, and because up air sort of like takes a while to end, you can't get anything. Except you do get a fair into an F tilt, which is good, um, into another fair, and you just don't really follow up on here. Oh, uh, you do. You fall down a bit and try and jump up again. You gotta remember, if she doesn't have another jump, which she didn't, because you took her jump, that she can only go down or up B. 
<coughs> in that situation, you should have gone like down here and hit her. With like a nair or another forward air. And here, for some reason, he goes away from the stage instead of towards it, so he dies. So I don't know what that was about. But lucky Jake. That was a, that was a, a perfect, nice single, a single percent taken. That was God tier. Um, there, not a, not a terrible option because Samus is pretty slow. So, like, she probably won't be able to punish that, but it, just remember that, like, any other character will punish that pretty hard. Also, this move is terrible. <laughs> like, side B is so bad. Never, ever, ever use side B. It's, like, one of the worst moves in the game. And because you use it, she gets a full charge shot, which can be, like, fatal. And again, you run in at her, and she can just roll away. And once again, uh, you jumped up high there. Um, oh, sorry. Once again, you jumped up high. Uh, here. You throw that, she gets full charge. Um, you extend it by holding down. And you see that she's charging, so you, like, go to attack. But, um, like, there's no way you'll reach her in time. And she'll just roll. So, like, it's really obvious she's either going to roll back or roll forward. So it probably would have been good to do, like, a forward air here. And then, like, if that misses, because it's Sheik. Sheik is friggin' super fast so she can just can she can like if she if, if she like rolls in and you fair you'll hit her if you if she doesn't roll in and she rolls away to the ledge she'll be stuck on the ledge and you can hit her with another fair um but instead oh shit instead you jump up and just remember in this game it's like never good to be above someone especially a sheik it's not very good to be above someone um, Nair is pretty good because it's really long and it doesn't have a sour spot. Um, but you gotta remember that, like, most up airs will beat out Sheik's Nair. Um, and Samus does beat out her, beat out your up air. It beat out your, I don't know what you did. I think you just landed in. Sorry, let me get back. Um, yeah, she just catches you. Oh, what is this? I hate so much. Yeah, she just catches you doing something. Um, but yeah, let's go back. But you, you get the fares off. Let's go back here. So yeah. Um, she rolls, and again, she rolls, and you just jump. You full hopped, so you weren't ready. You couldn't punish it. Just like short hop a bit more, because you're closer to the ground, and you can get down to her to punish her faster. But instead, she gets a jump up up air, which was pretty... Pretty fast up air, so good on the Samus's part. Um, realistically, he should have up aired you again, and then up beat you. That would have been the optimal combo, but he dropped the combo, and you put out a fair to like beat it out. So that was good. Um, you missed the fair. You s you spaced it. So like, you spaced it. Um, a bit improperly, cause like I guess you were expecting. Oh my God! Stop this. You expected him to, like, go that way so you could fair him there. But if he goes down that way, you can just jump up here and fair, right? If you go down this way, he'll get hit. If he goes down that way, he'll get hit. But instead, you go that way. So, you... Okay, so you have you have three choices, right? You can go back here and hit fair. Go up here, hit fair. That way, hit fair. This one, this hit fair only covers one option this hit this hit here if you hit there it only covers what one option him got like fading down that way right but if you go here it'll cover this option and that option because fair reaches all the way over there it's a very long move if you go here it hits that option that option and seeing as then she's more likely to go away from you to gain stage control it's probably the the best option to like jump up fair here in my opinion at least um you do another bear into F tilt, which is good. And see, here you drop the combo because they got too far away. Um, so. Uh, I hate this. Um, what you gotta do is, um, this is where perfect pivoting actually really helps with, sh um, <coughs> with Sheik's F tilt. If you, like, perfect pivot in, you can do more F-tilts and, like, rack up that damage to, like, really stupid percents. Um, but since she gets out, you're, you're stuck in another 
F tilt. And see, so you jump up and do a fair. You do a full hop. Whereas, like, if you fared here, you could probably you could probably fit in a nair or another fair in here to hit her. Whereas, if, see, like, I think your biggest problem is your full hopping instead of short hopping. Short hopping is, like, uh, you probably know what it is, but I'll just go over it for anyone watching who doesn't. If you short hop your fair, um, short hopping means you only go, like, a small way off the ground. It's only if you let go of your jump quicker than if you hold it. So you just go, like, tap the jump button. Um, and, like, she's probably not going to jump in that situation. So that's, like, probably a bad, a bad reaction. And she gets a grab for it, you know, because you're stuck in, um actionable frames you could have done something you could put another fair out but i guess you just you just uh messed up and she throws you off stage for it um that's a really really unsafe really super unsafe way to get back stage like sheik's up b is just so free like sheik has the best recovery in the game so like you really really should use up b rather than like down b to stage because you you're so so laggy when you hit there um if you like if you like F smash, like that, that Samus could have F smashed you and taken on quite a bit of damage. Um, oh, that was a good attempt for the up smash. That, like that almost hit. Um, you you go to roll, but like like I said before, she F smashes you and she hits the tipper, which is like really, really that never happens. Um, that was good. See, she went to charge and you needled, which was really good because now she's lost her full charge. And you tacked on, like, 7% damage or something. Um, you full hopped again, and it just totally missed her, because she rolls so much. So, um, yeah, a bit of an unsafe, an unsafe, um, you both did unsafe things. You, you up onto the stage, which will leave you in a bit of lag, and your Samus buddy... Uh, misspaced a bear so it, it didn't finish before the hitbox come out and you just F smash her for it. Good punish. That's, um, that's probably the best punish you could have gotten at that range. So, like, nothing wrong with that. Um, that was, like, that was good. Like, dropping down to get, like, that angle is good. Um, that's what you should be doing. But you just missed by a tiny bit. Um, you F smash again. So, like, Good, good coverage on, like, the fair to up tilt. Like, if she fast fell, she would have been hit by the fair, but you up aired, which was good. Um, you really want to capitalize on this sort of situation with Samus, because, like, when Samus is above you, her dare's, like, super slow. So, you, like, fast characters can just, like, really aggress her and, like, really bad. And her nair's, like, not as good as it was in Melee, where it was, like, the sex kick. It's just, like, uh, a backwards and forwards thing now, so it's not very good at keeping people off you from under. Okay, um, she grabs you again, see, you gotta remember, yeah, I know what that was, that was probably a missed input, you probably wanted to do like a, a down B, and she gets another grab on you, you gotta watch these rolls, cause you're, this Samus is getting a lot of grabs on you, luckily Samus can do shit all with her grabs, but you know, if, if, if instead it was a ZSS grabbing you, you know, you would have been dead by now, um, good B, I can't believe that fair beats out that. That's so silly. <laughs> oh well, this is the game. Um, good up air to get off your head. Good up air. You, you, see, you're taking advantage of her bad down B. Um, baited out the air dodge and killed with not B, so that was good. Um, so just some things I think you should like consider thinking of when you're playing your friend next is like, you didn't grab that entire set, I don't think. And Sheik's grab game is ridiculous. It's like... I don't even know how to put it. It's like... You get 50-50 mix-ups to kill. So, like, they if they choose one option... Any option they can choose, you just have to guess right and they'll kill them. And you have, like, combos that they can't get out of from forward throw and down throw. And, like, you have a million different options, options from grab. And her grab is really good. And you can boost grab it so it's like even better so definitely grab more um i think the biggest problem in your game is that you full hop way too much and that means like people on the ground can get away with doing things and you can't fall fast enough to get to them um 
short hop more, full hop less. Um, what else? Um, down tilt's a really good move that I didn't see you using. It's not like you really need to use it though. Um, at a later stage, I think right now you've got more basic things to work on, like full hopping, short hopping, and all that, and grab combos. Um, but if you if you like feel like you've mastered those sort of things, I think perfect pivots and implementing them into your F tilt strings, which is like F tilt, F tilt, F tilt perfect pivot in so you're closer towards them f tilt f tilt f tilt will like really really help you because it's just like you can rack up so much damage doing that it's, it's quite silly <coughs> um so yeah that's about it um i hope this helped anyway catch ya pudge out